All right, this is Yuzo Nightwing Game Summon of War. Uh, they had did another little quick update, and it's on World Boss talking about the level limit for monsters who can participate in battle has been changed from level 30 to level 15. Kairos Dungeon slash Risk Dungeon has been modified. The room rate of lower grade rooms has been adjusted with this overall room drop higher rate. Star grade room had been increased. For instance, the drop of five star rooms in B10 has decreased. The drop of six star rates have increased. By the amount of, oh my gosh, we'll see on that. How about just making it five and six star rooms and you get rid of the rest? Uh, Rift Dungeons, the drop rate is lower on gem slash grindstones have been decreased. Mm. Drop of rate lower star grade room has decreased. The drop of higher rate increased. For instance, five star rooms, hero or below gems with clearing of SS. Okay. Clearing of SSS. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Boo. <laughs> oh gosh. Wow, that is horrible. <laughs> we'll see how that works. Like I said, I'm eventually going to do some. D10 and G10 room runs. Uh, let me look at this. Finally, the Bloodstained Darkness Rise is coming in June. I couldn't figure out what 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 is that, but the problem is, is I can't never get on to the the actual website half of the time. That's why I haven't been able to do any other uh videos if they pop up any videos for anything it's hard to show up um, Okay, new monster coming in June. So, okay, that's all that was about. Oh, please, get me out of that. Get me out of that. <laughs> Good Lord, I don't want to get stuck on... <laughs> no offense. Really, <laughs> no offense. But, yeah, that's... that's... That's, that's why I kind of hate trying to go switching over from there and there to see the new uh, new stuff because it's so hard to switch back to YouTube and then you start getting uh, getting caught up in other folks stuff you can't just go right back to the game let me see if I can do this one Sorry, I'm just being really random this time. It's supposedly supposed to be finally that. Dimension is opening. So finally, that's supposed to be that. Uh. That uh, video is supposed to be fine. That area is finally supposed to be opening. So, hopefully, maybe they are going on and open with that. But that's why I hate switching between seeing because it messes up the game a little bit when you're trying to do that. So, that was out of two trailers that they were showing of a new monster and hopefully the thing that's been been unopened unworking since day one the mystical energy dimension hole is getting stronger hopefully by the end of june they are gone on and put something out else to play with um it was something else on here i've seen uh 
Go back to media, uh, developers notes. It was something else I seen in here. No. Mm-mm. No, not in there. Nope. Uh, let me look at notice. Oh, balancing and improvements. This was done on 527. Um, Art Angel Light Judge, they modification increases your defense by 20%, accumulates up to 5 times, 10% each accumulates up to 10 times. Okay, uh, Harpy Med Harp Medition Dark. So this is mainly it was light and dark on the first part. They add an effect, puts yourself to, oh gosh, puts yourself into sleep after using skill, can't be resisted or no other oh wow. Uh, Fairy Queen, Light Hurricane, uh, attacks the enemy three times with Whirling Storm of Light. Each attack has a 20% chance to decrease enemy attack by, by 10%. Uh... And after enemy, okay, and after each attack, 20% chance of weakening attack power for two turns, decrease in attack bar by 10. Uh, light Valk, uh, critical hits reduced by 15%, increased to 30. Hell Lady Light, um, I don't know why they're messing with light and dark moons because rarely nobody has all these, but I know a few folks are like this. Uh, here later, the added effect increases attack by by 10, continuous damage granted to enemy attack after. Okay, Sea Emperor, Water, Maelstrom, uh, inflicts damage proportionate to attack power, attack power, and attack speed now. Uh, Fairy King Fire, uh, added effect to Hellfire, weakens the enemy defense for one turn if successfully removed beneficial effects. Uh, Desert Queen Fire, Charming Voice, added effect if skill didn't set the enemy skill on max cooldown time, the cooldown time of Charming Voice will reset. Nice. Uh, Monkey King Win. Uh, Stone Monkey Passive decreases the incoming damage by 25% to 35%. Counter attacks with a 25% to 35% chance now when allied is attacked. Uh, Paladin Win effect added grants immunity on allies who have full HP for two turns. Uh, change AP recovery amount to HP shield proportion 25 to oh, 20 cent, 20% to that down. Uh, Coil Lord, Bomber, Dark, Magic Exterminator, added effect, removes one of beneficial effect. Parrot Water. What did they add? The damage increases by 50% in each beneficial, beneficial effect on enemies. Okay, that's cool. I like water parrot. Um, duh, grief. <laughs> Her name. <laughs> you just draw the bike on me. You can look it up. <laughs> Cowgirl. Okay, all of them. Increase damage by seven. Good. Fire cow girl. Uh, explosive bullet. Now the new attack is attack enemies with the explosive bullet and stuns the target with a 50% chance. Afterwards, all attacks all enemy and stuns them 50% chance. Okay, cow girl win light. Beneficial effect removing chance 50 to 60 percent now. Uh, cowgirl light again. 
uh, decreases attack by by was 10%, now 20%. Defense weakened activation chance 50, now it's 75. Sweet. Uh, Cowgirl, Water, Fire, Water, Dark, Defeat Wild Dogs, Critical Activation, 30% chance, Removes beneficial Effects with 50% chance. Cowgirl, Dark, Devil Bullet, Critical Hit Activation, 30% increases your critical damage by 50% when you land a critical hit. Alright. Uh, Panda Light has been changed. Increases accuracy uh, by 25%, strengthens their dragon dance. Uh, attacks all enemies three times to inflict damage that increase according to max HP. The first attack removes two beneficial effects. The second attack decreases the attack bar by 15%. And third attack stuns them for one turn, 25% chance each. Uh, sea Emperor Wind increases accuracy by 25%, increases attack speed by 15 uh, Paladin Water, the accuracy of ally monsters is increased by 55% in guild content. Increase the accuracy of ally monsters by 41%. Leader Skill Modification. Uh, light Paladin Leader Skill Modification. The resistance of allied monsters is increased by 55% guild content and increased allied monster 40.1%, so same thing. See Emperor Water again, a stat modification. HP type to attack type. The stat will be modified to meet attack type. Okay. Uh, skill errors that are resolved. Brownie Magician Water Harmless Prank improved the skill effect to be displayed in more accurate timing. Mermaids All improves some skill effects of Transmogrified Legend Abyss Mermaid. Okay. Lynch Light Endless Attachment. Fixed issue with invincibility effect being remained abnormally when the invincible effect gets activated with a bomb on your turn. Mm -hmm. Okay. Heart Magician Water and Light Nightmare Melody has been improved skill effect to be displayed in more accurate location and Kugar Kugar Total. Annihilation, fixed issue with number of turns of beneficial effect on monster not decreasing under certain situations. Oh, that must be TOA. Oh, okay. So that's the latest updates. Just go to uh, news and pre-monster balance improvements. <laughs> Sorry for my boo. <laughs> but, uh... That was a little bit of what's going on as far as what monsters has just been updated. I'm going to go on and post these too. And um, probably a little bit later on this week, I will be doing G10 and D10 teams, just posting some teams. And we'll see what work out. But if you want to ever look up uh, anything, they got little videos in here under the notice and developer notes that you can look up. So, this is User Nightwing. The game is Summoner War. And that's the updates and balances on some of the monsters and the two video premieres of what's supposed to be happening in June. Alright, catch y'all later.